There is not one member of the United States military who is in active duty. I'd like to reassure you that there are no... Uh, this is particularly going out to troops in combat zones around the world. You don't exist and you certainly do not matter. Well, I will tell you, I agreed with President Biden's decision to pull out of Afghanistan. Four presidents said they would and Joe Biden did. And as a result, America's taxpayers are not paying the $300 million a day. We were paying for that endless war. And as of today, there is not one member of the United States military who is in active duty in a combat zone in any war zone around the world. The first time this Wait, century. what? But let's understand. So where the fuck are we right now? Oh, that's, it's going to be very difficult to continue to condemn Donald Trump for his terrible attitude towards the military or his lack of respect towards veterans while that clip exists out there made for troops by troops. It's going to be difficult, I would have thought, for Hillary Clinton to continue to condemn those Americans that are spreading propaganda while we have a woman who's campaigning to be president lying to troops about their whereabouts. That's... This is why a clip like that shows you why there is an increase in censorship. If they had total control of X and Meta, etc., then that's the very kind of clip that would be discredited and condemned as misinformation. Certainly Hillary Clinton wants to create criminal charges and civil penalties against Americans that engage in spreading propaganda. And you can bet that the clip we've just watched would qualify as misinformation under the definition of Hillary Clinton. Let's have a look. Uh, just as Mueller indicted a lot of Russians uh, who were engaged in uh, uh, direct election interference and boosting Trump back in 2016. But I also think there are Americans who are uh, engaged in uh, this kind of propaganda uh, and whether they should be civilly or even in some cases criminally charged uh, is something that would be a better deterrence. Because That's extraordinary, isn't it? The attempt to criminalize all inconvenience is one of the hallmarks of this new regime that we face. We want the ability to enforce vague laws Keep them vague so that we can use them only when we need to. I had a brilliant conversation with Majid Nawaz about that very subject. It's a brilliant conversation between a British Muslim and, well, me, I'm the other person in the conversation, because you get to tackle some of the social tensions and the ideas around them, including migration, Islam, Christianity, secularism, the growing social tensions in my country. But I don't know what immigration is like in your country. I suspect it's something you care about for this month, for the next week only. If you use the code NAWAZ, N-A-W-A-Z, then you get one month for free. So uh, please, if you want to become an Awakened One, then get access to our content. Please use that. If I needed to make that any simpler for you and make it a little more patronizing, I could always lean on the skills of Tim Waltz's wife, who can make any information at all in the world seem so simple, so accessible. Let us turn a new page together into the great encyclopedia of corruption that the globalists want us all to be staggering about beneath the weight of. The image I'm using is, you know, when people carry a book on their head at some sort of finishing school. You've seen things like that. But I kind of liked it when she did this. Turn the page. You like that? OK. I remember not liking that. I remember feeling patronized by that. I remember thinking this is one of those things they think is really clever and that they're going to repeat ad infinitum, believing it to be some sort of catchy little motif that we're all going to be sort of swept. Yeah, I do want to turn the page on my life. Things have gotten a little bit tiresome. It is like that. Life is like a book where you can turn pages. This is the ongoing infantilization of the electorate, whereas independent media grants us the opportunity for open discourse sometimes carooming and rambling, but always respectful. I hope on this channel, for example, we always approach our conversation as equals communicating, often on subjects we disagree. That's why you'd like that Majid 
Noir's conversation because I know loads of you will disagree with loads of it. Like with the Matt Walsh conversation I had previously. In fact, isn't instantaneous communication and the uh, mir- miracle of a kind of omnipresent communication network that isn't part of that, the recognition that there are no longer polarizing discourses. There are nebulous networks of agreement that can appear and I uh, appear and become uh, not enforced or imposed. What do I want to say? That can be developed in order to uh, oppose centralism. That's why I'm so excited about Bobby Kennedy joining the Trump movement. That's why I'm excited about Tulsi Gabbard joining the movement. Let's carry on now with being patronized by the waltzes as they waltz us through their childish wonderland where we're all basically imbeciles. So I need you to be with me and practice with me. What are we going to do? We're going to turn the page. Oh, pretty good. Do it again. We're going to turn the page. And we're going to turn the page. All right, so I'm... We're going to actually disobey. We're going to disobey en masse. We're going to oppose. We're going to refuse to listen to your propaganda and your prejudice. We're going to refuse to let your sort of cosy affability and your tubby hubby make us believe that we're on the side of the righteous. We shall recognise this project of infantilization for what it is, an attempt to paternalise the entire planet. You know that care and control have a crossover. We really care for you so much. We don't want you to get this virus so maybe if you take this medication maybe if you stay in your house maybe if you live the rest of your life like a little mouse turn the page i'm gonna be watching you because when i see wisconsin which if we lose we it's impossible for us to gain the white house and i'm one watching national land tv because it's a pretty important place and minnesota help you practice with this you just show me this turn the page right turn the page and you know what else that looks like Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye, Donald Trump. We are turning the page. 52 days and we are turning the page. 52 days and it is. Bye-bye, Donald Trump. That disgusts me. I actually find that disgusting. I'm not easily disgusted, am I? I've got quite a strong stomach. I lived quite a life as a younger man. But that actually disgusted me. We can't continue to bring you this beautiful content without the support of our partners. America, listen up. The world is getting more and more unpredictable. Assassination attempts, rumors of civil war, unstable stock markets, and now the looming threat of bird flu. Do you know there's a bird flu summit this October? The first topic on the agenda is mass fatality management planning. Doesn't that send chills down your spine? The good news is this. You don't have to be scared if you're prepared. The wellness company created the Medical Emergency Kit. It's packed with life-saving medications like ivermectin and hydroxychloroquine, antibiotics like amoxicillin and z And it's all backed by experts like Dr. Peter McCulloch, the kind of doctor we all need, the kind of doctor that fought for truth during COVID. This is his product. A few clicks and this kit is delivered directly to your door. Your medical emergency kit isn't a luxury. It's a necessity. Protect your family by preparing now. Head over to twc.health forward slash brand and do use the code brand to ensure that you get $30 off. Do not wait till it's too late. Act now. Take control and ensure that you're protected against whatever comes next because you know they got stuff coming next. So that's twc.health forward slash brand and use that code brand to save $30. Plus, I can't even believe this, there's free shipping available right now. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to see more uncensored content where free speech can flourish, join our live stream. Click the link right here to watch the next video if you want to, or become a member of a growing movement. Download the Rumble app and you'll be informed every time we make a new piece of content. Stay free.